Tricycle Farms is a collaboration of staff, board members, and volunteers who work to grow community through soil while educating about sustainability. And here to tell us about an upcoming event, we've got Don and Emily That's joining right. us. Thanks for being here. Yeah, hello. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Thanks for having us. Yes, of course. Don, you've been around for several years. Remind us what you do out there at Tricycle Farms. Well, for since 2011, we uh, started a, a farm park in the center of Fayetteville. It's two acres, yeah. and we've been focused on creating experiences around growing our own food. You know, as you know, and as I learned, um, we have thousands of neighbors who struggle to put the quality of food and have access to fresh food, and um, they're working hard and trying hard, but in this economy, it's very difficult. Absolutely. And, um, you know, we're, we try to make sure that uh, everyone is aware that this issue exists in Arkansas with one in three children being food insecure, us topping the charts on uh, food insecurity, childhood obesity, which has all, all, all to do with uh, the quality of nutritious food that's not available. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah absolutely. Uh, there's a seed swap uh, coming up. How did the idea to host this event, how did that come about? Well, it was sort of a baton passing. Uh -huh. You know, there was a community garden coalition, there was the Dig In Festival, and then that when they were going to stop having their events, they talked to me and asked me to carry it on. So we had uh, five or six, I believe, consecutive <laughs> seed exchanges uh, at uh, Trinity Methodist Church right across the street yeah, from Tricycle. Sure. Yeah. 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 And, you know, two or three hundred people showed the interest and showed up and uh, we shared seeds with them. And, uh, and now we have a new partnership with the Fayetteville Public Library yeah, okay. and we're going to be able to use their event center. Yeah, that's oh, amazing. Nice. Yeah. yeah, that's beautiful. Is it, is it too, like with seed swapping, people are hmm. getting seeds right now, is it too early or too cold to start planting those seeds? I, I don't know enough about planting to yeah. understand that. Well, well, Arkansas, it's February, it's pretty cold, yeah. it's, it's, it's pretty cold outside, but it's never too late to start planning okay. to visit your extension service, you know, which is located over there by the fairgrounds, yeah. uh, to pick up uh, pamphlets on different plants and, and vegetables that you might be interested in that tell you about how to grow them in our area. Sure. Okay. And then, of course, don't forget Google and don't forget YouTube. <laughs> you can learn so much uh, and uh, answer a lot of questions you may have yeah. about yes. starting your first garden. <laughs> yes, I need Thanks. that. I, I do not have a green thumb. So. <laughs> uh, Emily, yeah. give us the details. The event's coming up right at the Fayetteville Public Library. Can you fill us in on that? Yeah, so the seed exchange is going to happen at the Fayetteville Public Library from 2 to 5 p.m. on Saturday, this upcoming Saturday. Yeah. And. Um, it's going to be a really great event. Um, we're really looking forward to all of the different organizations that are going to be there. We're going to have um, the Center for Arkansas Farms and Food. Um, they train farmers at their, um, at their organization. Um, UAMS, Healthy Food Systems. Um, Brightwater Culinary Institute is also going to have um, students there um, that have prepared um, refreshments for the event. Oh, okay. um, so that's going to be really great. We've Yum. gotten some um, some awesome seed donations from companies like Baker Creek Seeds, So Right Seeds, High Mowing Seeds, um, Home Depot. So we're really looking forward to it. Sure. Yeah. 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 I know. We're looking at photos right now about how much you all do in the community. Mm -hmm. So it, what other ways can our viewers get involved and support you and find out uh, more about Tricycle? So I post on um, Instagram and Facebook pretty regularly. Um, our handle on Instagram is at Tricycle Farms. Um, you can also find us at tricyclefarms.org. From there, you can sign up to volunteer through, you can volunteer in the garden. Um, we're also always looking for volunteers for our food recovery program, okay. which in this past year, we've um, you know, recovered 121,000 pounds of food. Um, so we run that program six days a week, so we're always looking volunteer for volunteers for that as well. That is awesome. Okay. Well, thank you both yes, so much for joining so much. us. You. And find yourself out there at the seed exchanges happening this weekend. We appreciate you. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks, Stay